hi my good people i'm Nyar africa yeah that's my name that i use to produce to upload my videos with sound so today being a friday normally i like to upload videos though i have not shared most of the time in my channel but every friday at least i normally have that free time whereby i can spend some time when recording my videos and doing something on the social media so today i just feel like i should share to you a very wonderful story of my two good friends yeah these two good friends they were happen to be employed to a certain organization here in nairobi one of my two friends was names was otieno and the other the other one was njoroge so here is their story that i would like you to listen to keenly and carefully and please don't forget to subscribe to my new youtube channel for more upcoming very interesting and educative videos here comes otieno and njoroge so these people they got employed for a certain company so the both of them were given a five-year contract so they signed the contract and each one of them was being paid fifty thousand per month so you see fifty thousand is a very good amount for somebody yeah even for me when i get that it's a very good amount so here's what happened to them but you know before getting this job he used to stay in a single room house 4500 in a certain estate here in nairobi so after getting the job he opted to move to a one bedroom house yeah a bigger house you see life was changing for him since he's now getting a very good amount of money and after moving to a one bedroom house he changed school for the kids since the one they used to go it was not of his level at this moment here you see the level has rise so he could not continue living the same life he used to live mm -hmm. so after that uh, life changes he could not even be able to board the matatus that he used to board while going to work but instead he chose to be using a private taxi driver who, who could, could, could be coming pick him in the morning same in the evening so you see my, there is money yeah life is good with what you know yeah so after one year second year i you know, opted to marry the second wife yeah so after marrying their wife obviously they can't be in the same one bedroom house Joe. so he rented another house for this lovely wife so after renting another house you see the levels are rising each and every time so and the expenses are increasing so the the other wife could not accept to live in a single house though he did she didn't have kids so after that the third year life was at least little bit tougher since otina has changed school for the kids now the school fees was higher and the other family so things were not okay with on otino's side so this is what he he chose to do he started borrowing loans at least to make the life of the two wives comfortable and his comfortable yeah you see the standard were rising so he didn't want anything that could could make him to lower his standard so he kept that yeah living that good life eh? everything is good remember years are counting 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 for the year he still was still borrowing loans and yeah just to make everything equal and good eh? so the fifth year contract is coming to an end yeah so that is otino's side so as fonjoroge after getting the same job that they were they they signed contract with otino Joroge used to live in a single house, 2,500. After getting a job, Joroge never moved to a bigger house. He stayed in the same house. And even Joroge had a family. Remember, he also had wife and two kids. He continued staying in the same place. First year, second year, third year, fourth year. Now the fifth year, the contract was coming to an end. And now it was a very tough time for Otieno since he has been borrowing loan and use for his own expenses he didn't invest but as fonjoroge when the time came for the contract to end he was not worried at all reason 
why he was not worried because he had he had money he had saved he was able to buy a piece of land somewhere he was able to build houses somewhere and and he was also able to buy a a, a car that he was going to use as a taxi to make his life to continue as usual and as easy and you see as for Otieno, he had no money in fact by the time the contract was ending he was a lender because he was a debtor yeah because he used to lend money and not to pay he used to lend money just to use for his own for personal use but not to invest in a business so a lesson to learn here my dear friends my dear sisters my brothers and any other person anytime you get a chance to get to be getting money somewhere please even if you opt to borrow a loan borrow the loan and use it to invest use it to do something do not use the loan for your own personal use as Fonjoroge, you see, even after the contract had come to an end, he was still able to provide for the family, and in fact, he was now the landlord. He could even he was able to collect rent, and remember, he also had, had a, a car. I mean, his life was just becoming better and better every day. As for Rotiano, he had no option but to chase the other second wife that he married, and again, the kids were going back to the schools that they were transferred from since the life was becoming tougher and harder every day Otieno in the end decided to move back to the village since he had nothing he was jobless he had not saved he had nothing to show at all at all so to my good people this is a lesson that you should learn you should share even to your brothers even to your sisters even to any other person around you yeah because this is something that happens and it has happened to the Otieno's family and it didn't end well for them since we don't know what happened after he moved to the village yeah so that is it my good people please 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 subscribe to my youtube channel for more and better educative videos bye bye